Well, hey guys and gals, what's up? It's Hex here, and today we're working on our big modern house number three. Some more. I went ahead and put in a couple of palm trees here, and I went ahead and did the rest of the wall here that we were working on last time. Uh, if you recall, so the wall is done. Um, what I decided to do is go with these chiseled brick walls here. Um, I didn't realize they had a little pig nose on them. Oh, well, I think they look pretty good, at least from a distance. <laughs> Maybe we'll go with a different block now that the I know they have the pig nose. A anyway, I put in uh, two palm trees. I'd like in this episode to finish this back and then hopefully finish a front yard too. That's pretty ambitious considering the size of this house. But that way, at least I'll be able to get a thumbnail and start getting these things out to you guys. But you kind of don't care about that right now because you're already watching it. So doesn't matter. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Uh, what I've been doing is I've been kind of building out some some palm trees. And it's been kind of an interesting experience. I've been trying to create ones that were similar to the ones that we built on, well, the reason I'm turning around is there's a modern house over there that we did. It's like a two-story one, I think. Um, the first one I did on this island. Anyway, um, yeah, so I'm trying to like recreate those. And basically what I've done is I've gone up a ways, I think it's about 16 blocks, 15, 16 blocks, something like that. And then I'm using the stripped birch. And then at the top we have the wool. And then all I'm doing is I've made a three by three pad and then I'm just building branches out from that pad like this. Um, so I'm doing like, the bottom branches are actually pretty easy because they follow kind of a nice little pattern. It's pretty simple. And then the upper branches, are difficult. I guess they're not really branches, they're like leaves. Or they call them fronds, like a palm frond. F-R-O-N-D. Frond. Frond! That's a weird word to say. Frond. Frond. I can't stop saying frond now. Frond. Okay. Um, that was weird. <laughs> got in, I got stuck on fronds there for a second. But anyways, the palm fronds, they grow out um, from the center of the palm tree, as you probably know and then come down this way. And I'm thinking of the type, I think it's called a queen palm, where the fronds are a little bit narrower and they're not like a like a flat leaf. They're sort of like a long thing, almost, almost like a fern, if you know what a fern looks like. Um, almost like the leaves of a fern. There we go. Okay, that's pretty good. Now, if, even if you just did that, like that would be an effective palm tree right there. That would be effective, but to get kind of a little bit more lushness to the top of it, what I've been doing is putting in some blocks on the top here. So starting kind of like, I don't know, right here, I've been kind of coming out two and then two like that, and then down and then one like that, and then maybe two like instead, like maybe two and then maybe one right there. Something like that to kind of get the effect of like the, the upper ones are kind of going and arching up over the top of the bottom ones. In fact, I'm just going to kind of go like that because that's what I did up here is I put a few blocks just sort of randomly on the top to kind of give this effect of like, yeah, this, this frond is going kind of up and over and down uh, on the tree here. In fact, I might even try something like that. Uh, yeah, that looks really strange. <laughs> It's going to look even more strange as we have more of those. So um, anyway, uh, we're going to go two there. Let's see. Now, where's our three? Okay, there it is. One, two. I was looking for the three by three um, block in the center. And then maybe like that. And then maybe one more. Like that. Okay, I need to get rid of this thing. This is freaking me out right now. And then you just kind of go around and keep doing this. And um, yeah, I'm going to kind of cut it short on the tree and then just sort of finish it up off camera just to keep the video from getting too long because we have an aggressive goal today. And uh, I don't think I'm going to make it if I work on this tree. Okay, there we go. That one's done. I also made that one, that one, and that one a little bit wider as far as these planter boxes. And I think what I'm going to do is get some plants and put in there real quick. Uh, what do we want to do? What do we want to do for some plants? Uh, yeah, I just kind of want like some tall plants and I want them quickly. Quickly, quickly, quickly now. Are we recording? Yes, we are. Okay, I <laughs> have to do that every once in a while. Um, gosh, 
Uh, ooh, bamboo. And then we want, um, where are like all the tall plants? There they are. Oh, I just saw them. This is driving me crazy. No way I'm going to get this thing done if I'm going to be derping around like this. Holy cow. Okay, there we go. Now, uh, let's do like some bamboo maybe. And a couple of these. That looks good. A couple of those there. Maybe one there with a bit of bamboo. A bit of bamboo just for you. I'm gonna let this bamboo grow and just kind of see what happens. And see if I like it. Maybe three bamboos there. Three bamboozles. There we go. And maybe like two there. Okay. Yeah, that kind of looks cool. I like that. I'm kind of thinking that when the bamboo grows up, it's gonna be too big. What are you going to do? What the heck are you going to do, you guys? Um, let's see. I'm thinking about to complete this, I'd like a little bit of a fire pit. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to come right here and we're going to go ahead and go with the, um, I want to do netherrack. I want to do a netherrack fire. And the reason I want to do a netherrack fire is because, um, let's see, right there maybe? And right there, is that an odd number, an even number? There we go, that's good. And then we're gonna do a bit of uh, black stone, polished slab bricks. The black bricks, let's just call them black bricks. There we go. I gotta come up with better names for these things. Otherwise, Hex is gonna be driven right out of his mind. That's good. That's good. Okay, you know what we're going to do is we're going to grab this and this and we're going to make like some little sort of chairs like this here. One, two, three, four, and then two like right there. And then we're going to go and make like little comfy baskety kind of chairs. There we go. I guess I could use the warped for this. Should I? Nah, that's good. That's good. We need we needed something slightly different so it wasn't like all warped. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with it. Okay, uh, flint. F L I N T. Flint and steel. Here we go. That's really nice. Okay. Go. A raging furnace! <laughs> I was like, why is that thing chasing me? Because I'm going backward. Okay. All right. That is good for now. Oh, you know what I wanted to do? Here we go. Lanterns. Oop. Ah. Oh my gosh. What am I doing? Lanterns. Ooh, let's use the soul lanterns. Okay. So, I don't even know where I was. I got a phone call. <laughs> that I had to answer. Anyway, uh, so what I did is I went ahead and put some lanterns on some of these blackstone blocks, and then I decided, hey, let's put some lanterns here and here and here, and I really love the look of these soul lanterns. They look absolutely awesome for this uh, w with this color combination. So... I went ham with them and put them everywhere. <laughs> you can see I put them around the hot tub and around uh, around here. And then I started putting these signs around them like this. And uh, this is something that I've seen before that people do. And it's a very cool technique to make a nice little lantern. And so I feel like this is adding quite a bit to the back here um, because it was honestly kind of missing some details and stuff. So we are gonna add those in um, in different places and see how it looks. I'm also going to probably put the uh, lanterns here on a post instead of sitting down like this. Yeah, uh, well, I'm thinking about doing this, basically that, and then this, and then this around. What do we think? I think I like that a lot. I think that's gonna look great and I'm gonna do it to all of the posts. There we go. 
I think that looks great. I think that adds so much to this back that I'm going to say that it's almost done. The only thing that I wanted to do was to finish this. <laughs> I know, I know. I was going to bring it like um, and have it not be over the beach, but I think what I want to do is actually bring it onto the beach here. And then we're going to like make stairs coming off of it as like the way down to the beach. I think that's going to look good. And I think I'm going to like it. So we're going to do it. There we go. Da, 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 da. Fill this in. Fill this all in like this. There we go. And there we go, like that. Beautiful. This just has such a nice flavor to it now, this beach house. It's starting to starting to become very um very nice, very good. Very much I like it. Very much I like it. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then a black stone thingy-mabob there, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then a black stone thingy-mabob there. Like that. Let's see what happens when we bring it this way. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then a black stone thingy-mabob there. So we're gonna have this kind of awkward corner. Um, I think, oh, you know what we could do? We just go like this. There we go, it's fixed. <laughs> just kidding. I am just kidding. Okay, um, we want the, uh, what is it called? Crimson stairs. I want some crimson stairs. Some crimson freaking stairs. Uh, no, I want some crimson slabs. Really? Really? Okay. Like that, and then like that, and then that, and then like that. Is that cool? I think that's pretty cool, you guys. That's pretty cool. So we're going to put like that there and that there. And this here, maybe? And that there, does that look good? No, it does not. That looks better. That looks better, I think. I don't know. Maybe like this? Something like that. Oh, X. I'm so indecisive today. I feel indecisive. I feel like pressure to get this done for some reason. I feel like you guys are pressuring me. Like, get it done. Get it done, Hex. I like that better. <laughs> That's the best. Okay. Sweet. And then you just come right up, and you're up on here. And that's pretty good. And then we could do, like, a little gate situation where it's, like, um, that. And then we could go like this. And then we're going to go ahead and put a thing right here with a lantern on it. I'll finish that later. Same thing here, like that, and then here we're gonna do like a gate where it comes like that and just make it like a glass gate kind of thing. There we go. That'll work. That will work. That will work, that will work. I like that. Very nice. Very, very cool. All right, I'm gonna finish this and then we're gonna start working on the front yard, I think. Unless I come up with any other idea back here that I want to do. Okay, there we go. I also made another important decision. Oh, did I not finish these? All right, I'll finish them later. I also made another important decision. I filled in the pool one more layer tall, and I think that that looks better, honestly. I was going to leave it one block low, but I like this better. And I did the same thing to the hot tub, and I think it looks really good. So I'm going to go with that right there. Okay, let's move on to the front yard. Let's move on to the front yard here. Um, let's see. The first thing that we need to decide is how far out do we want to bring the front yard. So I think that what I'm going to do is use the, the driveway as our metric. So we're going to come right here. And I'm actually going to go right over the top of the concrete that we have there. And we're going to pull this out. Ooh. Two. There. Is that enough? I think that's enough right there. And we're going to fill this in with um, set block. We're going to use the 
polish black zone, blah, blah, blee. The blacks, the black bricks. I don't know what my problem is. Paul, Paul ish. Um, black stone bricks. Enter. Done. Ooh. That's a nice a little that's a nice little driveway. That's a nice little driveway. I like that. That is good. Okay, so next what we're gonna do is we have to decide how far out from the house this whole thing comes. And I think we're gonna go right right here. Right where that sort of longer piece is. Like that. We're gonna use Double high pigs and glass as our mm. Ooh, you know what would probably look really good is if we did um, white concrete like this. We're gonna do white concrete. One, two, three, four, five. Like that. Actually, we should start right here, huh? We need to start right here, like on the side of this driveway. So one, two, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, is that five? One, two, three, four, five, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, one, two, and so on and so forth. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and do some blackstone uh, let's see, the wall. I want the polished blackstone wall. There we go. Like that. And I have my time set funny, uh, because I just really wanted to get that sort of beach feel to get inspired here. Ooh, that's looking pretty snazzy. Yeah. That looks good. All right, that's very nice. And then we're just gonna bring this here, two, three, four, five, and bam, like this. Okay, and then what I think we could do is we could take and do this, um, these crimson-y blocks here, the pink wood, pink wood, that's what it's gonna be called. I like that. Do I really like it though? Uh, we're gonna go with it. We are going with that. Here we go. I'm gonna clone that and put that around the front here and then uh, we'll do the next step. All right, as I was building, I made a little change. I went ahead and I put these guys, uh, I put, a, so like basically, instead of having it go all the way across, I put a white concrete block and then we're gonna go with this and then this with the signs around it like we have back there. That way the front yard and the backyard are very much congruent as far as, um, yeah, they have like the same style, basically is what I'm trying to think. All right, all right, that, that looks good. I really love these <laughs> this lamp style, it's very cool, very fun. Okay, so I went ahead and did that all the way across here and all the way back towards there and then I sort of, yeah, uh, the elevation changed, and I wasn't sure. I, I think I'm going to take it out all the way to the to the sand out there, but I'm not 100% sure about that. But I think that that looks really good, and I'm happy about it. Uh, what I'm doing right now is I'm trying to lay out just a little bit of a detail in the ground here. And then what I was going to do was to kind of make like a little bit of a, I don't know, like a garden in here with like kind of like a like some raised areas. And then I wanted some trees of course, a few more palm trees in here, uh, just to kind of be like a nice little garden area, but it's like really well defined by these blackstone slabs. And it is 11 blocks wide by, yeah, like that long, <laughs> however long that is. Um, yeah, so then it's going to kind of, maybe I want like a couple of hills instead of like one big hill in the middle? I don't know. Yeah, I think I do. So I'm going to tear some of this out. I know, like... It needs to be somewhat rounded, but like not a circle. You know what I mean? It 
something like that. I want to do a little bit further here. Like that, maybe. And I think that one block tall is going to do it. There we go. Okay, and then we're going to do the same sort of deal here. Uh, but maybe a little bit more circle-ish. Circle-ish? Is that a word? We invent new words here on how to build a Minecraft, because that's how we roll. Okay, I like that. I actually like that quite a bit. So then we're going to put some trees, uh, a couple of palm trees on that, uh, which I'm going to do later. And then I think, I think what we should do here is take this black stone here, this polished black stone, and come right off the side of this uh, driveway and bring this over here. And I'm doing four blocks wide because that's how wide the, the gap was there. I'm just going to bring this around over here. Like this. And then, let's see, one, two, three... It's going to have to get down to three at some point. Like that. And then we're just going to go like this. And like that. And maybe we're just going to make it three wide. Like that. Uh-huh. And then break this out. There we go. And then we're going to replace this. And I think I'm going to make this just a little bit thicker as far as like how far out it comes away from the house. This. There we go. There. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Okay. Very, very cool. And now that I'm looking at it, I'm thinking, I'm thinking fountain. <laughs> thinking about a fountain. Thinking about making a fountain right here. So let's dig out this area. Let's go, what, like right here. Uh, how big is that? Seven by seven. Maybe we should do nine by nine. Nine by nine, and we're gonna dig down like a couple of blocks, I think. We're just gonna do that. I don't know how far down that's gonna go, but it's gonna go pretty far. Okay, that's farther than I wanted, or than I needed, but it'll work. Okay, and then I think what we're gonna do is grab some of this stuff right here, and we're gonna go you know what I want? I want the stairs. So we're going to do black brick stairs. There we go. Some black brick stairs around here. Lots of black stone on this. I'm really liking the color of the black stone. Although it is kind of dark and black. Because it is the black stone! Because <laughs> like, Hex has lost it. I have lost it. I have definitely lost it. That's true. That is absolutely true. Okay, we're gonna do like this. There we go. A ring around, ring around the black stone. Pockets full of black stone. <laughs> That's good. Okay, and then you know what I want? I want. What are those things called? Uh, fungus lights. Uh, light? Lantern? No. What's the new block that gives off light that's like a fungus block? Uh, I'm never going to find it scrolling like this. What is that thing called? The lighty fungus. The light fungus. <laughs> Dude, what is it called? Uh, 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 is it in here? No. A shroom light, that's what it is. 
There, yeah. It just hit me. Shroom light. There we go. Let's try some shroom lights. I kind of like that noise. It sounds like somebody's hitting like a really big plastic drum. There we go. Some shroom lights. And then we want white concrete, of course, for the center. Not the powder. The full thing. <laughs> there we go. We're going to do white concrete in the middle. And then we're going to have a, a towering tower of white concrete. Like that. In the center. How does that look? Uh, let's see. And then we're going to do some water. On the top. Like that. Mm, it's all right, I guess. <sighs> that annoys me. <laughs> like, really annoys me. There we go. Okay, so... Things I like and things I don't like. I like the white tower. I don't like the white inside here. So we're going to get rid of that. That, okay. That's good. And then um, I want something more than just like what we have up here. So maybe like, I don't not even know. Something like this. And then I want um, the water to come out right there. Ooh, it's kind of interesting. Kind of cool. Um, I like that. Or do I? I think if we go like that, that would even look cooler. Yes. Yes, that's good. It needs a little bit of color, though. Maybe... Maybe it needs some of these things. On it. Like that, maybe. That's pretty cool. No. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no, no. You know what? I'm not sure what it needs. It needs something, though. Maybe some of these soul... Maybe a soul lantern? On the top of it? Yeah, because that makes it look way better. <laughs> Sheesh. Um... Interesting. Maybe? Nope. Don't like that. <laughs> this is one of those things where it's like trial and error. You know what I really like is I really like the... The, um, the way that the blocks are sort of... I want a cube, is what I want. I want a cube of blocks, like that. There we go. But what I don't want is this water right here. I want the water to be coming from here. There. That looks cool. That I'm happy with. That looks very cool. You know what we should do, though? We should, instead of making a cube, we should make a prism. So we should do like this, like that, and have three of them. Like that. Okay. That's good. And then... Yeah, that's good. Okay. Oh, you know what needs to happen? We need to do this because the water is like flowing everywhere in here. Why are you being a... Uh, why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing me like this? Oh, I know why. Because I forgot to put the... I forgot to do this underneath here. There we go. Haha! Oh, now it's better. 
That looks much better. <laughs> okay. It's hard to tell sometimes with these shaders. Uh, with this particular shader, especially because the water is very... Um, yeah, ooh, I like that so much, you guys. That might be the best. You know what? I, I, I like it so much that I'm just going to keep doing it. And then I'm going to put this literally on the ground like that. There. That might be the coolest fountain I've ever made. You guys are like, huh? But that looks really cool and modern. Oh, yeah. That is really cool and really modern, and I really like it. And I really hate how this is going on top of the ground now. So we're going to bury it in the ground. Do, 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 do. Okay, that's done, and it looks 150 bazillion times better <laughs> now that it's down there. Um, the next thing that I want to do, I'm, I'm not... Well, I don't know exactly how I want to approach this, but I, I, I think that this thing in the middle right here, I, th I think it's got to go. I think it's got to go. Um, yeah, this has got to go. It's got to go. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I kind of like the idea of it, but um, I want to do something a little bit different. Uh, I'm going to take it in a different direction. I've been having a little bit of trouble, to be perfectly honest with you, trying to figure out um, how to do some landscaping in more of a modern way on this flat ground. And, um, yeah, so I think I've got kind of a better idea of how to do it. Um, I actually took a short break in between the last two clips to kind of kind of get a little snack and um, also to, you know, to kind of actually look at that. So I think what we're going to do is take this all the way out to here-ish. And we're just going to fill it with those... I can't do that right now. Why not? Okay. Can we fill a region? Set block. Uh, let's see. Polish. Uh, Blackstone. Enter. There we go. Okay. Whoops. All right. That's good. That's good. I like that. And, and then what I think I'm going to do is use some white concrete in here to create what I'm looking for. And also maybe, uh, let's see. Let me just get out some white concrete. Okay, got some white concrete out. I've got an idea. I've got a bit of an idea. So um, I'm gonna build these little planter thingies. I actually saw an image a while ago that I liked and I, I think that I might try to make this because we have enough space here to create something kind of large so I'm going to do, uh, let's see. Now I want to move this over by one. Here we go. Like that. Yeah, like this. Okay, there we go. And then, you know what? You know what? I, I don't like this whole location. This location is whack. <laughs> there we go. We're going to put it here. A little bit like right there. One, two, three. And then we're going to do a, like a three by three like that. And then... Um, I'm going to do a five by five next to it. One, two, three, and then one. So, and then there we go. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Like that. There we go. Ooh, I kind of like this. I kind of like this. I was thinking about making it double tall, but I think, well, um, yeah, we're going to do it. I'm going to make it two blocks tall, like that. And then this one's going to be like this. And we're going to go three blocks tall on this guy. How's that going to look from the front? Oh, it's going to look weird. Okay. Uh, we're going to leave it as one block tall. Sometimes you just have to, like, experiment. And I know that I'm running out of time. I'm probably over time right now. And you guys are like, hex. We're tired of watching these 40-minute ones. <laughs> Actually, no one has complained about it. So one, two, three, four. So I don't know why I'm worried about it. I don't know why I'm worried about it at all. There we go. Okay, that is interesting right there. Now what we're going to do is fill it full of uh, some... How about some grass? There we go. Fill it full of some grass. 
just like this. Bam. And then bam, 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 and bam. There we go. That is beautiful. Ooh, I like that quite a bit. Should I do another set? Should I do another like five? One, let's see. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, three, four, one, two, three, four. Yeah, that actually works. And then let's see, one, two, three, one, two, three. That's actually gonna work. Okay, that's good. I like this. <laughs> this is interesting. Uh, one, two, three, four. No, one, two, three. And then we do here this. Oh, there we go. One, two, three, four. Wait, something's up. Let's see. One, two. Oh, I need to go this way one more. We got one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Why did I do that? One, two, three, four. Uh, yeah, this is all messed up. What the heck? There we go. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, like that. And then we'll do one more little one of these guys. One, two, three. And then we're going to go like this. There we go. Da, 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 da. Okay, cool. And then we're going to fill these full of grass. Like that. There we go, like that. And then what I was thinking of doing was creating like a shrubbery. We need a shrubbery. So we need some leaves like this. And we need some sticks like this. There we go. We're going to create a shrubbery. So this one's going to have a bit of a shrubbery. And then this one is going to have a larger shrubbery. Like that. And then this one's going to have another shrubbery. And then we're going to have another shrubbery here. Something like this. There we go. I kind of like this. It's interesting. It's very... In Whoop. <laughs> what am I doing? Uh, does that one look good like that? No. Maybe something like that. And then this one here, we need to fill with grass and do our shrubbery. There we go. Okay. Very nice. Very good. And very nice. And then last one. There we are. Okay. There we go. That kind of simulates the image. It's hard to build like good, convincing looking um, shrubs in Minecraft. I will tell you this, that that is a difficult thing to do. Okay. Okay. Hex is fairly happy with this. Hex is fairly happy. All right. So next, what I wanted to do was grab some, um, I want some concrete powder that is gray. Do we have gray concrete powder? Here we go, gray concrete powder. I just wanna see how this looks to kind of create like some some rocks and gravel. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Stop it! There we go. Ooh, I kinda like that. There we go, so we're gonna have like some gravel along here. Just kind of along this edge of the path right here. Just a bit of gravelly gravel. There we go. I like that, and we're just going to go all the way around this, too. There we go. And here, like this. Uh, but then, you see that there, it's going to kind of mess with our fountain. Oh, well. Oh, well. There we go. Da, 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 da. All the way across here. There we are. There we go. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Nice. Do I like this? Stop it. I like that quite a bit, actually. Yeah, that adds quite a bit to the pathway. Okay, then we're going to do that, I think, around each one of these. A little gravel. Little gravel around it. Ooh, I'm liking that a lot. That's good. Okay, stop. Go. 
that's nice. <laughs> there we go. We'll skip ahead and do the rest of them. Okay, there we go. I like that pretty well. I also did around the garage because it looked a little strange to not have that. And I also put a couple of pieces right here um, to continue it right here. Mm, yeah, I, th I think I like that. Maybe we should break this one and go like that. I don't know. I don't know. There's no half slab version of the concrete powder, unfortunately, but what are you going to do? Okay, then I think we're going to go ahead and just, just going to do kind of the stereotypical bushes in front of the window thing. I think that's going to work well. Like that. That's pretty cool. There we go. Da, da, da. Da, 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 da. And just like that. I like that pretty well. That's good. Okay. All right. Let's get cooking. <laughs> let's get building. Here we go. Um, I think I kind of like this grass area in the front. I need to continue this pathway back there. And then another thing that I really want to do is I want to put just maybe a couple of palm trees in the front here. I don't want to overdo it because I don't want to like hide the house in front of the palm trees or behind the palm trees, I guess would probably be the way that something would be hidden. Um, but yeah, yeah. I think that if I put them in this area here, that would look good. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and then I'll catch up with you guys in a minute. Okay, so I put in three, four, five palm trees in the front. And if these all look the same, that's because they are. I just <laughs> grabbed that one right there and cloned it a few times um, with the bling edit tool. But uh, that saved me a lot of time as far as building it. And I think they look really good. I think they look just, just great. Um, yeah, then what I did is I moved this over by two blocks. So it was like two blocks away from here. Now it's one, two, three, four, five blocks, including the gray concrete to the, to the, to the deal there. I just moved it over a little bit because it looked a little oddly spaced between this and this. And speaking of oddly spaced, uh, got to fix this. Okay, there we go. And then, um, then at the base of each palm tree, what I did here is I built uh, a little bit larger base here. So I put a block around every one, and then on one of them, I put two blocks up just to kind of give it a little bit of a nice um, supportive bottom to the thing. And then I uh, put some pods all around it. That is a, I think it's a five, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it's a seven radius, seven diameter circle and then a few nether sprouts just for some color. And I did that at, on this one and that one and that one and that one. And then also I added just a little bit of a start of a pathway heading back there. Um, yeah. And then I did this pathway here uh, from here all the way back to here. And I still need to figure out what I'm going to do with this fence, if I'm going to take it here or if I'm going to bring it over. I'm not exactly sure. But um, at this point, that's going to be good enough for this. So I think that that's going to conclude this episode of how to build in Minecraft. And I'm pretty happy with the way that this front looks now. Well, guys and gals, this has been Hex. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of How to Build in Minecraft. I hope that you've learned a thing or two or saw a little trick that you liked or maybe just got inspired or maybe just had something on in the background while you did something else. Anyway, <laughs> I hope you're having an amazing, awesome, beautiful, fantastic day and stay safe out there. And God bless.